and yeah, I'm gonna come back with some friends and they'll hang out with me. And I want this established. It's, not a lot of people could do that like that, but I'm established enough to, to pull it off. Yeah. So I just, I'm gonna hold it. The good thing about me is, you know, unquestioned that I'm next. Mm -hmm. Like, I filmed a documentary in here eight weeks ago. Mm -hmm. Before, you know what I mean? So they weren't here long. Uh, this is a tunnel that goes down to the other room. Mm. And the other room is where they had another lady, Ruby, transgender lady. Um, this person came on in here a couple weeks before Ruby died. I said, I'm gonna get rid of her. I, don't hate, I hate her. She fucking murdered. I thought she was gonna be like, get the fuck out. I don't like you, whatever. And the lady ended up dead. You know, and then after, this was the disturbing part. After she died, I heard her and another girl. Um, uh, disparaging their gender and sexuality, fucking disgusting, and blah, 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 for a dead person. That really disturbed me because Ruby was a beautiful person. I was happy she was here. They took advantage of her. Uh, I, it's the only theory. I believe that they killed her. I believe that. Um, it's really terrible. And remember, I found a body, another transgender person. Where's my closest neighbor, Stoney? Where's my closest neighbor? How did he get there? Both of them were shot up all day long here by Kima. I heard from multiple people. I believe them. And she victimized everyone. She's shooting them up with heroin and they both died. She transgender people and she's clearly like transphobic. Are you okay with uh, put this online? You can do whatever. I'm, gonna, you know, I'm transparent. Come get me. My, my strength and my weapon is the truth. That's, the, that's my weapon. It's true. Fight the truth if you want. Uh, the police are already looking for a questioning. You know? So if they don't know about the story yet, the connection, but you know, I'm happy to tell them because they're families and it's not right. And there's transgender people. There's two vulnerable, endangered people who are dead. I, I held one while, while they died. And, and people need to know. That's also, yes, please, you're doing me a favor. I'm going to sit in here tonight. These are my friends who support me. And, I asked everybody that you could see from here, and 100% of them said, yeah, go take it. I gave it to her. I'm going to take it back. But to do that, but to say you're not to fight it. Now, thankfully, I got props like that. I'm well known. I'm pretty well liked, even by the dark side. So nobody's going to give me too much of a hard time, but uh, I may have to fight to defend it, and I'm prepared to do so. I, I want it bad. I'm going to make good things up here and reverse the evil. So we're done. I did the same thing in Goonies. They raped children down there. I put him out. It's all in public in my thing. We protested him. He came back a year later. We protested him out again. I took the camp over. And we did good things with him. We served the community with So that's what I'm trying to do here. This was a beautiful place. The people who built this, Chris and Christine, and a couple that were here for eight years. Go look at some of my older videos of this place. I've been a member of this bunker community here. The people who built it since I got here. I was the neighbor in the back for two years. And you know, I just kept parking. And they were here for two years in the front, so everybody didn't really know dispute that, like, it's my turn. It was already my turn. I gave it to a couple, because they were new. They promised to do good things, and, and they're terrible evils. I mean, two people are dead. Mm -hmm. I don't take that seriously. But it's not easy, even for somebody like me, who's well-known and respected. I'm going to have to sit here and I'm going to have to fight with this, and I'm prepared to do that. Got a lot of friends who support, so mm -hmm, that helps. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm gonna sleep here tonight. Mm, you're gonna sleep here tonight. Yeah, you have oh, to. Is that, that's I have to uh, occupy it. That you said that goes to the other bunker, now, right? There? This is what the documentary. I took their camera because the crew oh, didn't right. want to go down there. But I took their camera down there, went to the tunnel, and whatever. Yeah, okay. Wait, there's a bunker down there. This place down there? was beautiful. This is a little hole. This leads to the other. Side. There's a tunnel that goes to the other side. Oh, Demo, like maybe we, you can leave me down there. I'll go down there. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, now the great thing about this is it's highly defensible. It's highly defensible. The bad thing about it is, uh, if this is on fire, uh, you go under, all over, or you die. Get everything out. Mm -hmm. It's, very, it's a death trap, and I've seen this thing burn a dozen times. Get People fight over it all the time. Hmm. So I'm gonna sit here. It becomes like an oven type of deal. Mm, yeah. I mean, it's nice and cool if you don't notice compared to the other. Right, stuff. right. That's true. I'm gonna make it really nice for the dude that I have to occupy it. So I'm gonna do so. Um, you know, for a lot of people also have the idea, so I have to get in here tonight, and sit in here, and you know, most probably with my friends and, and greet everyone who comes. Yeah. Play this mine now. I'm one of the people who get away with it, you know, like, yeah, Brian, he's been a long time, like, you know, people like that, like, normally we don't do this for new people, 
only three bones because I'm most class. Wow. You're very highly prized. This I is like a... Uh, very nice one. Just more than very... Yeah, yeah, the um, tanks on the other side. I mean, these are like, you know, these are the crown jewels of... Yeah, yeah, this, yeah, this is like the... And it was my turn and, then, and I gave it to someone to try to uplift them and they use it as a platform yeah. to hurt many people, including me. They're watching the top of your binocular, they go take a bath and they rob me. He's coming back and very organized and yeah. terrible shooting people up and they die. And sexually trafficking people. Yeah. Terrible, terrible things. Yeah. I felt a responsibility that stood up on that uh, for the last few days, which I do sometimes. And rather than uh, start a war, a shootout, I stand on top of my roof with a microphone and put my fucking amp up to 12 and they hear me on the other side of the class. <laughs> you kill two people and they're here with me and I'm speaking for three of us up here. And, and I can let you get away with it. And the police are coming tomorrow, and news are coming tomorrow, and I'm going to tell them all about it. And you're not going to get away with it. So run. And get out of here. And that way I don't have to have physical confrontation. You know? But it's a serious business, you know? I mean, two people are dead. And it's serious. I take that serious. Two transgender people. That's personal to me, you know? So, uh, it's a time in here. I mean, it's crazy last night. And, uh, yeah, it's going to be a crazy night here. I'll film. So I'll send you some film and everything. Um, but yeah, it's gonna be uh, interesting. I got some trailers to pull up here, and uh, my friend Nicole is there. So I'm gonna leave one trailer there for her and give her that camp. So, yeah. You could occupy two, I guess. They're right next to each other, but I don't wanna do that. I'm gonna bring the other trailers up here. I have two or three up here. And uh, yeah. eventually pave that road nice and uh, listen to it. But that's what they did. You said desert treasures before, the other side was a museum. It's beautiful. They put a lot, eight years of beautiful work into it. Mate, this is amazing. Go watch the videos, it's beautiful. Like, I can't do what they did, but they don't have to be this. And then at least, this is my camp right now, a pile. And talk to Nova. <laughs> Nova, how are you going to compare your, your camp to my camp? Right? There's so much there, it's like an oasis, and, it's, and, and with beauty and style and grace. And, and don't compare your camp to my camp. I live in a pile. Give me one of the best compliments I ever got. Uh, yeah, but it's a pile of love. Yeah? Uh, I'll take it. It is a pile of love. Yeah. So I appreciate that support because I've been to Flamingo. That's goals. <laughs> so then you're going to keep this one and the other one that's on the, the, on the other side? This is all one bunker. They did some bungalow roommate bullshit. Uh, they're the only person who's ever done it. It's always been one family, one bunker. Okay. They live right, in half and they did some apartment. Yeah, I don't live in an apartment. There's an apartment. This is my living room and that's my bedroom. This is my okay. hacker space on one side okay. and my living quarters on the other side. And okay. I can, you know, yeah. Ah. It's just more highly defensible for me. I have a lot of equipment. It's like, uh, nice and cool. I can, you know, yeah. I want to turn it back into something good. Just, just give it, oh, I remember it, what it was. was you know, this, is, this is like a little house, man. Compared to how we live, right? You know? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Beautiful. On the other side, I got the kids. 